I've been focusing on fixing my deadlift form. Here is a set after a back and heavy deadlift workout, just focusing on form, 185 for 15, which isn't supposed to matter in this set, but I let my ego get the best of me and did too many reps. My main problem in the deadlift was my butt coming up really early on. And that has improved a lot. It's not perfect, but it's much better. And of course, focusing on not rounding my back. As you can see, as the reps progress, my back rounds a little. So I need to get my ego out of my way and, you know, not do things like this. Maybe this could have been a set of five, and I would know that it wasn't for heavy weight, it was just for the form. But I pushed it. And next I'll show some other recent deadlift sets and talk about the form and limiting factors and helpful factors. Here is a set of three that was supposed to be really heavy. My butt's coming up a little early, but it's much better than it used to be. And my back rounds a lot less than it used to. I just think about squeezing my shoulder blades together for that back rounding problem. Here is 265 for five a couple of weeks ago. And I can even see that this is before my weight really started dropping. That is the limiting factor I wanted to discuss, that I lost about nine pounds in the last month, actually, and I'm feeling pretty weak from it. Here is still when I was feeling strong. And now here is some work with the trap bar. I'm told this helps with the squat and the deadlift. I need to do more research into that, but it was fun using the trap bar. A little change of pace. I do feel it sort of kept my form better because I'm holding the bar on the sides, not out in front of me, so my back can be a little straighter. And that is my lifting update. We'll be posting more frequently soon. Thanks for watching. Happy lifting.